Dr. John Jabour, WHO representative for Egypt here in Tunis, we're discussing with the parliamentarians. Dr. Jabour, Egypt has shown the world that when there is a will, there is a way when it came to hepatitis. You've managed to cure how many people? Uh, to cure until now uh, 3 million out of 4.5 million discovered positive for or living with hepatitis C. And the drugs are available now, produced in Egypt? They are all available in a very low cost, produced locally in Egypt. This was a very different example. It had the highest political will from the president himself. If I were to ask Dr. John Jabour now, how you would elicit the help of parliamentarians and for which health issue as priority in Egypt? We have a very high priority in Egypt is the tobacco use. And I think the role of parliamentarians is very important. The role of having uh, the correct uh, legislation is very important. Uh, we need to enforce the law. And we need uh, a very good uh, collaboration between the government and the parliament to enforce the law. But if and the laws are already there, what will the parliament do? Okay, there is a convention. Uh, uh, the WHO uh, framework convention uh, tobacco control, uh, tobacco control. Uh, this uh, convention needs to be also a part of the legislation and it has to be reviewed and, and let me tell you that uh, we as WHO we need uh, the capacity building at the parliamentarian level. Because even if they, we have a convention, even they, they have a law, there should be capacity building. And this capacity building should be reflected in the law in order to have uh, a good connection, a good link with the government. By capacity building, you mean to improve the skills of the people who are working in the parliament? Exactly. And this is also one of the discussions that we had yesterday in the meeting and it's not only to build the capacity for the framework but building the capacity for preventive aspects because public health is very important and needs to be as as an approach needs to be strengthened within the parliament so we kind of hope if we visit egypt soon we would find very clear places where there are no smoking especially and you know only restricted places indoors no way. No way. And this is uh, what we are doing. And this is also we are advising the government to have it in the new capital to be a green city and without any harm to any individual, to any Egyptian uh, in the future, inshallah. We wish you all the best. Thank you. Thank you.